I'm going to show you how to draw the Triquetra. It is an Irish Celtic knot and symbol. It goes back to ancient times. And it's been with me, it's like following me through my life. Comforts me, gives me guidance and inspiration. First of all, you basically start with kind of like a triangle, but also kind of like a football, like that. Then you'll do the same thing to this side. And to this side. This is the way I figured out how to draw it. It might not be the official way. And you can always fix this up as we go along here. It doesn't have to be perfect right now. Now once you get this general shape, what you do is you connect these two lines and you bring this all the way up to the top. Try to keep it center line like that. And then you'll take this one all the way down here and try to keep the center line correct and then you can bring that down okay <clears throat> this one like that and then all you have to do is bring that back around and then this one back this way like that and then once you get the basic shape you can have fun with it you can now if it's drawn perfectly it should look pretty even whichever way you look at it so you can see it's a little bit off center but you can always try to improve upon it what I like to do is I give it a little more of a dimensional look by shading it a little so you can bring this up like this and thicken the <coughs> <coughs> this is also a tricky way to cover up your defects so it looks better See that this part here needs to be much more like that. Now, this is actually a pagan symbol, it goes back before Christianity, but St. Patrick used this very popular Irish symbol. To illustrate Christianity and the doctrine, the scriptural doctrine of the Trinity. Because Christians believe that God is one, but that He exists in three persons the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And as you can see, there is three distinct shapes but yet one substance see it's a beautiful symbol it kind of just kind of grabs you and holds your attention that is the triquetra I can do a lot better of course she can do all kinds of fancy things like pointillism you can make it look even more three-dimensional and I used to like making little, like almost like flamish type of things. So it's like, looks like it's shining, almost metallic. So you can kind of get into it if you really do. If you spend a lot of time, you can make it look better and better. That is the 
try.